Let me leak a little secret to you. But you will act as if you don't know anything about it. Okay? Okay. Uh, uh, this is actually supposed to be a surprise. He got the ring to engage you. To engage me? Yes. Mom? You mean, you mean Toby wants to engage me with this ring? Yes. I am so happy. You remember I told you that he will change. And I am happy he is trying to change. Oh, I even you. got a pastor that is praying for him. Oh, you did? Yes, I did. Oh, I love you so much. I mean, I don't know what I would have done without you in this relationship. I don't know. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mom. Thank you. It's all right. So please, you, you have to return this. At the very spot you found it, and remember to act as if you are not aware. Okay, okay, okay. Just return it immediately before he comes back. I think it's yes. done. Yes. Uh, yes, I'll do that. Just <laughs> yes. Mom, what are you doing here? What is this habit of you coming to this house without calling? Can you at least give me that little respect by calling me before you come to this house? My husband's house, you mean? Tobias, did you build the house? Have you forgotten that this is my late husband's property? Well, I'm not disputing the fact that this is my late father's house. Mm -hmm. But, Mom, just give me a little privacy, okay? Please. I have the right to come here anytime I want. Yes, I don't need your permission to come here. Okay? And mind you, I have the spare keys to every room in this house. Therefore, I don't need your permission to come here. I know you would have sold this house if not my clothes market. And for the fact that you do not have the documents. So I don't need your permission, okay? I might equally decide to pack in here and leave here. Uh, no, 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 mom, 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 you can't. You can't live in this house. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Who is she? Uh, who is she, Tobias? Huh? I'm asking you, who is she? Oh, that's, that's Juju. Oh. She's my cousin. <laughs> Tobias. Hmm? When I thought I've seen it all. So you are now introducing me to your cousins that I don't know of. This is serious. Which cousin and from where? Mom, see, you don't need to be dramatic about it. Yeah, she's just my friend. She came to help me fix something, that's all. As an electrician or mechanic, what is she fixing for you? Hey, excuse us. Juju, just take a bag upstairs. Okay. Don't miss me too much. Thank you, ma. Nice to meet you, ma. Yeah, what's up? Do yes. Huh? I thought you really changed to be a real man. Ah. 
So you want the whole money I spent on prayers for you to be a waste? This is two weeks you bought an engagement ring for Mercy, and you are yet to engage her. Now you are here with another woman. I must see. Tobias, listen. Listen first. Okay, I'm listening. Do not let Mercy come back to this house and meet her. Okay. I am warning you now. Mama. Don't let Mercy return from work and meet this girl in this house. Don't worry. Have I made myself clear? She's not going to stay long. She's just here to, you know, fix something like I said. She's going to go. I'm so ashamed of you. I warned you again. Mercy should not come back to this house and meet her. Mama, you said it before Maybe. now. Why are you repeating yourself again? I'm not deaf now. I don't get it. Ha. In my own house. Juju! Wait, I'm coming here. Busy with school, and then this or uh, something. Oh, I see. Mm -hmm. So tell me, what batch are you in? Batch. Mm -hmm. You don't wear batch. Uh, I mean, are you in batch A or batch B? Oh, I'm in batch B. I see. Um, your cousin told me that you're serving in the States. Yes. So where's your PPA? PPA? See, you have to forget those things. See, I am not into politics. I don't know do all those PPA, PC, SSA, SD, NMPC, all those things. No, 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 no. I don't do it. I just concentrate on my studies. I read my book. So, I'm not into politics. Um, what she wants to know is your place of primary assignment. Yeah, I understand. And after that, I'm not into politics. I, mean, I, I think she's stressed, you know, oh. coming all the way, the journey and everything. Okay. Oh, wife our wife. <laughs> Go and change, please. I'll bring the food for you. I'll be upstairs. I think she saw him then. No. Are you sure? She didn't see anything. No, don't worry about it. Okay. Because I don't want her to be angry. Because of the money you want to collect from her and give to me, you know. Don't worry, I already took 50k from her last night. I'll take the rest and give it to you. Okay, okay. Let me just check up on her. Okay? Alright, I'll be back. Yeah. Great! Wonderful! I knew it. I knew it. I knew it all along. I knew that a day like this would come. Cousin, brother and sister indeed. How dare you? How dare you? Why did 
<laughs> Maybe they've gone through the back door. I don't know. I don't know where they are. Okay. Let's go and come back to meet me in this house. I don't know. Let Tobias go and come back. Let me go. I can't bear this anymore, Mama. I can't. I can't bear it anymore. Said to see me. I'm coming. Don't stay here. I'm coming. Mama, you still here? Oh, you thought I have gone, right? You want to kill somebody's daughter in my house and go to jail? I will make sure that I kill you myself before you go to that jail. Mama, stop that now. Okay, see. Go, go, eh? go, go, go. Come here. Mama, to you mama, prostitute. Mama, Come back here. Leave her alone. Why are you embarrassing leave me now? Alone. You're embarrassing me. Ah, my woman is saying you're embarrassing me. Who's your woman? Julius now. Hey. Yes. Tobias. Mama, stop it, stop you it. You are not ashamed of yourself. Ashamed of what? Calling her your woman. <laughs> are, you no, are, are, are you normal? Why are you going with that bag? Uh, you're going home. For what? I feel God you come back with that bag. That was only two. Why, why are you going home? Come on, come on. Come on. See, see what you. What is all this now? What is all this? Hey! Hey! Just go and call you. Hey. Yeah, go and call you. Hey. Hey. Mama, sorry, sorry, sorry. Let me go. Don't touch me! Don't touch me! Why would you see me? Why would I see you, Toby? You don't love me. You don't take me seriously. And you've brought Messi back into your house. So what do you want me to do? Baby. Baby, 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 baby. Hold your horses right there. Baby, I love you. I love you so much. Look. I know what I'm doing. Okay? I brought 
care about because I want money to flow. Don't you need money? Of course I need money. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. That's the whole idea. Like I said, I know what I'm doing. Trust me. I got you. Okay. You're going to be smoking that all along? What's wrong with you? Problems, you know. Oh, yeah. Last, last one. contributed in restoring my health and sanity. Yes. You have proven to be a very good friend of mercy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You're welcome, Mama. Mm. I really thank God that everything is normal. Mm. Mercy is my good friend. And the best part of all these things is Toby is not a good man. He's not good. Yes. Bad. And I am so happy. It's my dream to have Mercy as my daughter-in-law. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and do you know what, Mama? Mercy loves you as her own mother. Mm -hmm. mm. She loves you so much. I know. <laughs> I know. Where is she? Is she not around? No. She said she had an emergency at the office. Oh, yeah. did you call her before no, coming? No, I didn't. Hey. I had a low battery. Okay. How oh, good. Mm. I can't wait for her. I have a lot of things to do. Okay. All right, Mama. All right. I need to take my leave. It's all right. When I charge my battery, I will call her. Okay. Okay. Take call her, no? I will. All right. Oh, bye. 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 -bye. Here comes my lovely, beautiful bride in beauty. Good afternoon, my Good afternoon, my dear. Mama, how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine. You're looking so beautiful. I know, right? <laughs> Thank you, Mom. Thank so tell you. me, how did your meeting with your parents go? Hmm. My parents. Mom, they are so excited. Mm -hmm. I mean, I have never been this happy all my life. Child. My mom would not stop dancing. I mean, she has been dancing everywhere, rejoicing. <laughs> and my father said he'll be meeting with my kinsmen. Okay. Yeah, so as to prepare the marriage list. Mm -hmm. In fact, as long as my family is concerned, we are fully ready. We are ready for the wedding. <laughs> I am so happy. I, I can't wait, honestly. I am so happy right I now. So I'll be going too. to the market by the weekend mm. to shop for my accessories. Mm. Okay. Mama di mama. <laughs> Even the materials for the ashwabees, they are ready. They are ready, right? Mm -hmm. Very soon, I'll start distributing. Well, you know what to do. Right? I'll be back. <laughs> Alright. Huh. This wedding is going to be. I am so happy. But the, your wedding is in a few days' time and I'm not seeing it in you. What do you mean by that? Well, what do you want me to do? You want me to write it on my forehead and be walking around? See, bro, not really. You see, I expected that you call your friends, you form us, or maybe you form a committee of friends. You got no flu for your friends. My friend, when do they carry my matter for you? What do they worry you now? Huh? <laughs> I'll be woman where I'm going to worry myself because of wedding. Mama, see, I did tell you two nights, you shall. My friend, shut up your mouth. What's wrong with you? Why are you talking to me like that? See, you know my guy. And if 
Don't I know if you tell you nobody could tell you. Ah, come on, shut up. You married a man a few days time. I go break your head. Oh. My guy. My guy, stop now. What? what? Ah. Are you I'm okay? Calm down. You know, my guy. Anyhow, move. You move. You move yourself. <laughs> Yo, married man. Itchy. <laughs> God, what is really going on? Why am I having this feeling that Toby may fail me again? No. I will just disown him this time. It is few days to his wedding, but I'm not seeing any preparation on his side. Oh God. I really need your intervention now, like never before. I can't watch Tobias hurt this girl again. Never. is really taking her time to make my dress. Mm. I mean, I can't wait. The detailing, the style is just mwah, top notch. It's going to be a beautiful day. A day I can't wait for. I can't wait either. I love you so much. Me too. Yeah, that reminds me. Um, just have it on my back, please. Yeah. <sighs> Thank you. Hmm, so heavy. What's in there? Women's stuff. Women's stuff. Hmm. These women and their stuffs. This is 500,000 Naira. So I want you to add it to the one you already have, you know, just to make some preparations. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Oh, baby! <laughs> <laughs> what? what? <laughs> 500,000? Baby. Come on, honey, it's, it's for the wedding. You know what? Yeah. So, I want to show you how grateful I am, so what? I'm gonna take you to my land of pleasure. Tobias, I want to have a word with you. I'm in the mood for any conversation. No, it can't wait. It can't wait, please. Just sit up, sit up. Um, I want to know how far you've gone with the preparations. What preparations? The wedding, of course. Oh, the wedding. Um, yes, everything is fine. I mean, everything is going as planned. Ah. I even have to meet my friends concerning the wedding. Ah. Yes. Well, now tell me, what and what have you done so far? Hamai, I just told you we are on track. Everything is on track. Tobias. Your plans had better be on track, as you said. Because if anything should go wrong, I will curse you. I will disown you. And I will make sure you never get a dime from your late father's wealth. <laughs> Now maybe the first person won't know where they are. Hey. Hey. Oh, I leave me alone.
Tobias will never dare me in this house. My daughter, please, do your thing, okay? Go on with the preparations. This wedding must hold. Else, Tobias will have me to contend with. Yes. Mama, you won't believe that. Toby hasn't gone to see my parents. To collect the marriage list. And the wedding is a few days. Eh? Hey! I'm really worried. So worried. God forbid that Tobias will kill me before my time. No! I'm so, so worried. Really worried. worried. Okay. What is it with everyone in this world? Is this the only wedding going to happen on earth? Why is everybody so interested in this wedding? I am not everybody. And my interest is clear. Mercy is my friend, and I talked her into accepting you back. And remember, I have invested a whole lot of energy and fun in this wedding. And if it goes wrong, <laughs> Toby, you will face my wall. You stand in front of me to threaten me? Are you mad? Is something wrong with your head? Do you know I can beat you and nothing will happen? Stand on that! You can't do anything. You can't do that, Bobby Johnson. Try it. Try touching my skin and I will pour my anger on you. Do you think I am messing you beat anyhow? Try it and you will cease to exist. Rubbish! Nonsense! Are you serious? The wax girl is trying me. Okay. This one, your face is like this. Is your friend not around? Mama, I didn't come to see my friend. And meanwhile, she's not around. I came to see Toby to warn Toby because I am so much involved in this. I am supposed to be her chief bridesmaid. I organized all the Ashobis. All our friends are involved in this marriage. Mrs. Kinsman prepared the list and Toby is nowhere to be found. He didn't go pick that list up. Who does that, Mama? Hey. <laughs> What am I what am I supposed to do now? What am I going to do? Just, just tell me, tell me. This is not a crying matter. Eh? Go and talk to Toby. Go and talk to him. You know before now, Mercy's family disowned Mercy because of her constant stay with Toby. And Toby is doing all these things. Eh? I know. Please, my daughter, you have to calm Mercy down for me. Okay, but just talk to her. I, I am trying. I am trying my best, honestly. I've been trying to talk to Tobias. Eh? I, I've, I've talked to him several times to make him understand. But, but, but please, talk to Mercy. Oh, if that list is what I will go and pick myself, I would have come there and pick it. But it is meant for elders. I can't go there alone. Eh? Oh, okay. please, 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 calm them down for, for my sake. Oh, please. It's okay, Mama. I will. Just try to talk to me. I will. I'm trying. I've been talking to him. Oh, okay. How could you? How could you waste five years of my life for the stupid job that you put up with? Toby, I never forced you. I never did. So why are you putting me in this shape? Why? Why? Stop being dramatic about this. <laughs> My mom is around and I don't want to get her involved in this. And besides, if the wedding does not happen tomorrow, it can happen in a month or even a year. <gasps> I hate you! You are a bitch! You, you are a bitch! I hate you! You are a bitch! Are you Watch for it. real? Watch are you it. for real? I thought you are worse than a bitch! I mean, how could you? God will surely punish you for all this!
your mouth be quick. He got me right on the hook, yeah, I love him. My mother loves me, he cares for me. I love him, Marsta. I think that I lost my mind being a mess, being a freak. He got me right on the hook, yeah, I love him. My mother, he loves me, he cares for me. Yes, my skin. This? No, go get all your properties. Bella, please. I have my toiletries in here and I'm okay with it. Can let's we go? go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It's okay. I tried to revive you as a son, but you failed to be revived. I saw your video making out with your so called cousin in a hotel room. Spending the money that poor innocent girl gave you to finance your wedding with her. Tobias, I will be living your life today, but I will curse you for bringing black men and shame upon my household. The same way your children, that is, if you will ever have one, will do to you. Once I live here, I will be going back to the UK. And for your information, Everything your father labored for will be safe and better with the charity than anything So you're going to support an outsider against your own son? You cease to be my son the very moment you betrayed my confidence with this man. Did you cook? Which money am I going to use to? What about the 5,000 naira that you were paid from the labor work you did? I gave it to the woman I credited Mary from. <sighs> Toby, are you sure it's not time we start selling the properties in this house? Like the fine chairs, the AC, the beautiful TV. Do you know how much you will make from selling that AC? We will eat to our field. You should sell them. Sell them and use what? Oh, okay. You want to be sitting on fine chairs, be using big TV, and be using AC, uh, uh, and then uh, die uh, of uh, hunger. Uh, 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 uh. Juliet, don't make me see you as a very wicked person. So you want to ruin my life? <laughs> okay. No, Wahala. Let me go and look for something to eat. I can see that you're not hungry. Let me see how you will wear my food to this house and eat it. It's better you eat it there, but if you bring that food to this house, we will eat it together. Oh. But you don't want us to sell it. You want to eat it. We will sell your clothes. It's your clothes that we will sell. Not the chest. You should sell the chest. You should have much money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Toby! Toby! What kind of 
sweet is that one that's supposed to supposed to finish it. Who took the two K in my bag? Who took it? He used it. What for? Tell me to so use the whole two K. I did not even keep one naira for me. Uh, 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 uh. I made five K. I used some of that money to pay my debts. Then I used some for transport back home. You took the rest from me. Meanwhile, you had 2K in your bag. So when I saw it, I took it and I used it. Uh, I'm not agreeing. You will give me that 2K. You give me that 2K. Because I don't understand how I will be in this house. I will be feeding you. You cannot even take care of me. I don't I, 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 are you serious? How dare you open your mouth to talk back at me? You made me sell my father's properties and we squandered the money. Now my mother has seized the documents. You're sitting here and blabbing because of 2K. My fiance gave me one million naira for our wedding. What did you make me do? You made me gamble with half of that money and we finished the rest. Now you're here telling me because of 2K. That you're <laughs> okay, shut, shut up your mouth. Shut that mouth before I close it for you. Let me hear you make, make any sound again. What's child? <laughs> Please, Mercy, even if it's for a second, know where I stay. I, I am happy you've given me the opportunity to get closer to you. But at least you need to come and visit me. James, you refuse to give up. And your tenacity has earned you this time you get to spend with me. Hmm? Well, there is no doubt that we are now together. But I can only visit you on one condition. Just say it. Whatever it is, I will do. There will be no intimacy between us until marriage. Yes. Look, that is because I don't want to experience what I experienced in my past relationship. Okay, fine. No intimacy. It's okay. But but at least we can. Just get me the document, the documents, and then we are in for business. Okay, uh, that would be a little bit of a problem because the document was in our other house, which got burnt down. But I can give you a receipt, you know, so we, we can just take it from there. No receipts won't be a good idea. See, this is a property. A property this big needs something like a document to cover up all this. And uh, you know, there should be an affidavit to prove that your father gave you this property. All right? Just get it and we are good. And how much are you selling this whole property? Just give me 10 million. 10 million. This is my house. I live here. You can ask the neighbors. 
My father gave me this property. Okay, 10 million is not bad, okay? Just get that. Who's that? <clears throat> I said it. Tobias. So you want to say this house? Um, sorry, sorry. Who the fuck is this? I don't know him. He's just barging to somebody's house like that. Young man, you know your maid is not the problem. The important thing here is for you to know that this house is not for sale. That is number one. Number two, this is my inheritance from my late brother who happens to be his father. That is not true. You see, this young man here with his mother have sold everything belonging to me and my late brother. And now, the mother, out of criminality and everything they are planning and they have in mind, ran away with other properties money they sold. And she even left with documents of this one. This, that is why he is trying to lie to you that the document got bought. It's all lie. Are you hearing me? Hey, dude, this is my house. And I live here alone. Uh, uncle, what is all this now? Uh, uh, excuse me, I thought you said you don't know this man, but you're calling him uncle now. He's my uncle, but he's doing too much. Why would you interfere in my, in my transaction? Why? You see, I like your wisdom. Despite the fact that you're acting like a criminal. He is living here alone because I allow him to spot. Very soon, I will take over my property and find his way. What? If you pay a dime on this property, number one, you will die in jail. Number two, your money is gone and your name is sorry. That is all. Okay, this is my house. Um, 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 listen, I don't know. Uncle, stop this. Old. Stop this thing that you're Toby, doing. Toby, wait. I don't know what is happening here now, but I think I should take my leave. Maybe when you guys are, have sorted yourselves out, you can come back for business because I really no, no, no. like this place. Yeah, okay? let's, let's finish no, no. this. I like this place. I'm good for business. Just sort it out with him and then get back to me. Okay? Please now. Bro, don't come back home. Uncle, what is this now? What, what is wrong with you? You can't say this house. You cannot say this house. From this very moment, my eyes are on you. Fatal. Go and look for one room outside into that Me, place. I should go and look for one room. Because of what? I'm, I'm coming to lock up this property. <laughs> Be warned. Are you serious? Yes. Go out there and look for one room. Because I know you cannot even pay for a flat. This is my father's house. My father's house. This is my house. This should be the last time you step your foot in this house. I have told you. Can you imagine? Look at this man. When my father was suffering, where were you? Coming to stand here. Uh, if you buy his house, uh, you don't suppose you'll be arrested. Let's go. Tired of that. Uh, see, Bella, you deserve more. Thank hmm? you. Mess is the best thing that has ever happened to me in my life. <sighs> that girl, do you know that before I wake up in the morning, Mercy, she has cleaned up everywhere, she set up everywhere, and she always makes sure there is food at home. <sighs> in fact, that girl, she treats me like a baby. Wow, that means you're enjoying it. <laughs> Come on. Honestly, what else can I say about Mercy? She's so amazing. You know that sometimes she will always try to run the house with her own money. But I will tell her not to bother. I don't know if she thinks that I'm her ex that used to extort money from her. But do you know that whenever I mention Toby's name, her ex, she gets angry. Don't even go there. Don't even try it if you don't want her to leave you, don't mention that stupid guy's name to her. That guy is in bad news to us. Please. Okay, I've heard you. Uh, I should be on my way, eh? You know what? You are a good girl. <laughs> and God will bless you with a good husband. I am now. <laughs> <laughs> you know you have a whole lot of friends, so collect me to one of your friends. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have problem at all. So I can all. be happy like you, yeah, I'm <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I need to run my love. Alright, uh, thanks for coming. Okay, I'll take care. This game. It's good. I'm coming! I'm 
It's okay. I am still highly optimistic that she will come back. Now she's the new guy for me. By the time she come back to come and beg me, I will show her that I am the guy's guy. See, now I have accepted Christ as my Lord and personal Savior. <laughs> no, for real. And if I look into the spirit world, I see mercy coming to this house to ask for forgiveness. She will come back here to ask me to take her back. Don't worry, you see it now. Guy, I see you. You're very funny. What about Juliet? Who be that? Juliet. Mm -hmm. How can I take Juliet back into my life? Huh? That girl is evil. She's the reason Mercy left me. And she's a thief too. Do you know why? That engagement ring where I buy to propose to Mercy. You know, she's in Yes, now. Now, you take that ring. That kind of girl, eh, she would extort money from you to go give a man which love. So, you know. Love? Yeah, now. She would extort from you. Juliet can never in her life love anyone. She does not have any altar of love in her. Juliet, love. So let me tell you, the only thing Juliet knows is rounds, money. <laughs> rounds, money. That's all. Say love. <laughs> see, see, we are mad, uh, see, see that Juliet, eh? any guy that she decides to love, eh? she will really click the guy. She will pay the person very well. It will be the same Juliet way they stay for this house before. Uh -huh. Now we will talk about. Say good day. <laughs> ah, Pastor Toby prophesied that this day will come. What did I tell you? I said I looked into the spirit world and I saw mercy coming into this house to ask for forgiveness. I know this man now. <laughs> You came to ask for forgiveness and you came with this man. It's been two months, Mercy. Two whole months. And you're not coming to ask for forgiveness. You're bringing this man. See, the only way I am going to accept you, the only condition is when you kneel down and beg me. No, I, wait. In fact, I've changed my mind. I've changed my mind because of this man here. See, I can accept any apology, but not from this man. Never. Well, you're wrong. I'll say I'm wrong. <laughs> Meet my fiancé, James. And we're engaged. About to be married. Is it? So I came here to pick up my remaining belongings. And he's also here to assist me. Now if you excuse me, I'll be right back. Yeah, 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 yeah
This is the right time for you to kneel down and beg this girl. So kneel you, down? Yes, now, so that you don't come back and start crying. Oh. Kneel down in front of mercy. Guy, I am a man of God. <laughs> and the Bible says, no man should bow down before any mere mortal or any god. A man of God like me cannot kneel down in front of a mere mortal. It's not possible. What are you telling me? I'm telling my own guy. I've told you, just this is just the right time. I'm not going to kneel down. Guy, see, you better beg now. Hmm? It's not later now, you start crying. You come back to me, you start crying. Cry because of mercy. You don't, you don't see. <laughs> You know, you don't know, see the girl. I'm gonna cry for mercy. Hey. Huh? Guy, beg them. Beg this girl. Mercy. She's not come out. Mercy. Ah. Excuse me. Ah. Excuse me. Ah. So, you want to leave me because of this man? Why? Because of this man, you want to leave me? Are you serious? Respect yourself. If you don't stay away from my face in this minute, I will damage your face. Wait, 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 wait. Look at her very well. Is this not the same woman? You came to me demanding for money so you can forget about her. Is she not the one? Talk. Say something. Huh? Yes. So you actually wanted to sell me out for money? I did not sell you. Toby, after everything that I did for you. Olga. Okay. Well, congratulations. Because I already sold myself to him. Oga. Okay. And we are getting married soon. Oga, okay, did I collect any money from you? Hey. Let's go. Mercy, what is it? What is it? So what do you leave for, for, for this man? Huh? When can we go? Can he make you feel? Do I make you feel? Hey, Mercy. Mercy, wait. Don't touch me. Mercy. Hey, wait. Take your hands off me. Please. Just respect yourself. I respect myself. myself. You respect them yourself. Them. I'm talking to Mercy, not you. Respect yourself, stay in your lane. Allow them go, guys. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you two? Why are you stopping? contributed to why he fell down and sustained the spinal cord injury, which paralyzed his legs. He needs so much care and love now from people that love him so much. Doctor, his mother is not in the country at the moment. So I suggest we employ a nanny, I mean someone to take care of him. He's suffering from psychological and emotional trauma. He needs someone whom his heart truly accepts to revive him. He might not live up to one year. In this case, so many people don't live up to one year. But the luckiest ones do live up to one year. Why the unlucky ones just stay up to six months? So he needs love and care. Thank you, Doctor. I will discuss it with my fiance. Let you Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, you look disturbed. What is the problem? I think he's not about to be. I know I swore never to have anything in common with him. But Toby needs my help. Toby needs your help. Who says so? See, you have tried enough for that guy. 
You've given him your help by clearing the hospital bills. The mother's international number is not going. She's no longer on social media. No WhatsApp. I can't reach her anywhere. She has finally given up on Toby. I don't blame that woman. It's better to be childless than to have a son like Toby. So what do I do? What, what do I do? Toby really needs my help. Your fiancé is not happy about this. I know that. I know. But I can't help it. He felt bad when he saw me crying at the hospital. But you know, Toby, the words he said and his tears made me cry. Look, Bella, that I am alive today. Toby contributed to it. And he wants to take the life he once saved. See, Mercy, don't allow Toby to, to blackmail you with those tears of his. Don't. is in a bad situation. He has the doctor said he has few months to live. You know, I went to see him at the hospital today and he he told me that he would not leave if I leave him. And he promised me that He's ready to change. He said a lot of things. He confessed to me that he knows he has lived a bad life and he's ready to change. He doesn't want me to go. He said he still loves me and he can't do without me. He said his friends, his family, everyone has abandoned him. He even threatened to kill himself if I leave. He threatened to kill himself. I don't know what to do. I don't know. He also said he's changed, that he's now a changed man. He said he's... He no longer do those bad things that he normally do before. But Bella, I don't know what to do because I can't be with Toby. I am already with James. I am engaged to James. So what do I tell James? I don't want to hurt. I don't want to hurt James. I don't want to. <laughs> I want to thank you for accepting to take care of me. You don't need to thank me. You should thank him. I mean, if not for his approval, I wouldn't be here today. Um, Toby, I want you to cooperate with us so we can help you. The doctor said you need as much care as you can get. You don't need to paint the words for me. I know what the doctor said. I only have six months to a year to live. No. Don't say that. You're going to leave. You won't die. You need to have faith. Okay? Um... So I'll be taking you to one of the rooms downstairs while my fiance and I would stay in one of the guest rooms. You'll be fine, okay? Mm -hmm. 
Excuse me, guys. Um, let me pick our stuff from the car. What is wrong with you? Why are you being moody? Look, you need to thank James. If not because of him, I won't be here today. What's wrong with you? Whatever decision you make, I cannot object it. I'll just ask God in my next life I meet someone like you. So I wouldn't make the same mistakes again. Stop saying that. I'm trying to lift Sorry. You're so kind. You were kind to me before. And you saved my life. Toby, I will do everything to make sure you get back on your feet. I'm also talking to a foreign doctor. I told him about your condition and he said there's a possibility you will live. What's the point to live? Tell me, what is the point? Why did you just let me live for six months and die? No. Yes. You will not die. Mercy, seeing you get married to another man will make me miserable. I can't take it. You won't die. You will leave to be a better man for your mother and for yourself. Excuse me. here for me. Hmm? I am here to cover up for Mercy, my friend, who went to the office to handle some things. You think I'm one of those women you can sweet talk? Hmm? I'm not one of those ladies. 
So don't take me for granted. Bella, if I have ever offended you, I am sorry. What is that? If you have over or what? I don't know. I don't understand. If you've offended me many times and you're saying if. Please. I'm thirsty. <laughs> Can I have some water to drink? Yeah, test. You see? You see how life is? Hmm? You are pooping in your body right now. You are urinating on your body. You see, all oh, this is your gara gara. All oh, this is your coffee. Beating women anyhow. Treating people anyhow. Last lad, this is where you are. On a wheelchair. You want to drink water? Don't worry. Let me go and get you water to drink. looking at me like that stop looking at me like that don't melt my heart with this your look it won't work for me what is it see eh? see if it's not because of me eh I'll push you down from this wheelchair I will do worse things to you. In fact, I will break your bones. Not because of her. But you see, if I hear any of these things from her, if you tell her any of these things, hmm, you will die the next day. You are a wicked man. You are a real monster. You are shedding tears. You are a sense man. I have to face reality. I see a strong connection between Mercy and Toby, even in his present condition. The way Mercy play and laugh with him, and each time I come, she will just adjust. This shows that she is just with me for pity. I need to tell myself the truth. I am a man. I need to be loved and not for pity. No. I granted Mercy the permission to stay with him. It is true he can't make love considering his condition. And I have no right to accuse Mercy for anything. But God, I am so jealous. Me that is healthy. I don't even flow with her as she flows with that guy. God, I need help.
so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. That is great. Easy. Yeah. You did amazing. What's about my kiss? Is that your request? I thought you were going to request for money. You that I know. Money doesn't move me anymore. Yes. Even if I have all the money in this world, it's worthless. But getting a kiss from you can help with my healing. He got me right on the hook, yeah, I love you, my mother, he loves me, he cares for me. Where's my skin? Deep it in eyes. What? <gasps> this is it. want me to do right now? What do you want me to do? You caused it. It is all your fault. If you had changed any enough, I would have considered it in my life. See, I do not go back to my words, not minding if they are going to hurt me or not. I do not. Listen. I have engaged the girl I want to marry. And nothing is going to stop me from getting married to her. Nothing. James, please, I beg you. I'm so sorry. I'm very sorry, see. I'm a changed person now. I know the problem you had with me was smoking. And I've quit smoking. See, I'm even coming from fellowship now. I'm trying to be a decent girl, please. Lie. You traitor. So after gallivanting with my ex, you are here again to ruin my own home? Huh? Honey, you're back. Were you listening to us? Yes. I had everything. And I know you don't have anything to do with her. She's the one throwing herself at you. Exactly what she did with Toby. You see this girl here? She's the reason why Toby and I separated. Juliet. So you know Toby? Toby and I were not meant to be. I'm meant for you, James. Please. I'm a changed person. Please. This is nonsense. Now get out. Get out! Get out! I do not want to see her here. Tell her to get out of here. You hurt my wife. No, please. Let's go. <laughs> out, out. Out! Get out! Drop this. Okay, it's just a home breaker. That's, that's Toby's ex. She was dating Toby. It's okay. And I, I promise you this. You have showed me nothing but love. And the last thing I would want to do is hurt your feelings. I would never want to do that. You're the realest man that I have ever seen. For letting me go take care of my ex. That's the hardest decision for any man to make. But you led me through. I just want you to know that I love you so much. And I love you too. You know it, right? You know I love you more. I know. I love you. 
I don't do anything to make you happy. All I want is your happiness. But what are you trying to say? I will draw the line towards anything that will make you happy. And that's why you're the best. So, now that you are here with me, who is taking care of me? My friend Bella. I told her I'll be sleeping over here. So, I begged her to help me take care of him. And she accepted. Good. So, what is your next plan? Or are you going to be there taking care of him forever? Uh, no. No. After six months, I will leave. And uh, by then, he should be able to take care of himself. Or maybe get a nanny. That's what I plan to do. It's okay. But thank you. Thank you for letting me do this. Thank you. Let's go to bed. This boy, you are a witch. You know how to penetrate into people's hearts with this so witchcraft. But it will not affect me. I know who I am. Eh? You're using this your sweet mouth and this your cunning attitude to make waves into Mrs. hearts again, right? You see? your face like that. I am sorry. I'm sorry. Just that you messed things up. Eh? And this time around, it is too late. With you, it's not too late. came here and comforted you the way you were treating Mercy. You wanted to fight me. You wanted to beat me up. Now look at you. Huh? Look at your drugs. Look at your drugs. I don't have anything to say to you.
purpose that you have a heart of gold. Mercy, if I shouldn't be grateful for anything, I should be grateful to God for bringing me into my life. I thank God for hope that I will live and breathe the air of life, hoping that I will work again and not branded to die in the next six months. God bless you. And oh, um, I cooked for you. You did what? I cooked. Though it was stressful, I had to reciprocate the love you, you know, showed me. Knowing that you're going to be someone else's wife. If only I could turn the hands of time, I would rewrite all I have done. But it's too late. I would have to live with the regrets knowing that I've lost you forever. You didn't lose me, okay? Yes, I, I know I'm going to be someone else's wife. still here and we're friends friends you say that is not enough knowing that I'm not going to see you every day it's boring do you know that could actually reduce my longevity please can you stop saying this? You don't have to wish death upon yourself. You will be fine. I've been known for food only. Hmm? I'm a grown up man now. See, I bought something for you. Did you? You bought this for me? Wow, thank you very, very much. Thank you. You're welcome. Damn. Um, Bella. Yes. You know, I might not have rich parents like the way you people do. But I managed to pass through the four walls of the university and yet there is no job. And that's why I managed to live my life on the low the way I see it. So, I don't know. Um, don't see me as if the only value I have in this life is food. So that's why I manage to please 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 stop stop. stop it's okay i am not judging you bright i was only joking okay i'm sorry about that 
Please let me go and get you something to eat. No, no, no. Thank you. I, I didn't come here for food. I came here for a very important thing. What is it? Bella, what about that stuff I told you about the other day in Toby's house? I'm, I'm very serious about it. I want you to make me a complete man. Bright! Did anybody tell you to come and tell me all these things? No. I came here on my own. now allows you to drive his car, spend his money. My dear, he sent me to come and buy something for him. And then stock up his house. Of course I'll use the car. You see what I'm saying? That guy loves you. Yeah. Yes. You know, there's some person that don't know how to say it, you see? Action speaks louder than words. True, but anyway, everything concerning me, I have handed it over to God. I've got this mom. I've got the run up for me. I've got run up for me too. <laughs> that he's recovering speedily. Thank you so much. Thank you. So, I need to retire back to the house. My fiance is really worried. We we're supposed to be here together, but he went back to the house. That man is a good man, and I don't want to hurt him. Um, the guy is almost fit, but he still needs some mental correction and experience. He was able to rec uh, recover quickly because you have a strong connection with him. And it's that connect that has made him to be active. Uh, the result has been out because of that connection. You see, paralysis is something that has a connection with the brain. And the brain needs to be setting before it can reset. This thing is really affecting my relationship. Can't we get him a nanny at this point so I can return back to the house? Well, you can go back to the house if the guy is not so dear to you. That if anything happens, you can be here. But if he's so dear to you, then try and give him some time to reset. Toby is very dear to me. He was supposed to be my husband, but I guess the devil manipulated him. But now I am entangled and committed to someone, and I don't want to break his heart or hurt him. I understand how you feel. All right. I understand it. But you know, this has to do with saving someone's life. I know this has lingered for over four to five months now. Yes, I know. But just in a month time or so, he might be okay going to go out and play with friends and stay with other people. Hmm? But thank you. Thank you for the marvelous job you did. Thank you. Yes, God. I almost lost hope when the doctors said he was going to die. Uh, no. It is not totally his fault. It is from the lab technicians. You know, the result was not clearly stated. But it is good he is getting better now. So, 
and the tech wedding. It's fine. You did great. What about my gift? Um, I'll be the one to choose your gift. Hmm, what do I give you? <laughs> I am someone's wife now. So back off. Without showing up. What's going on? My baby. You know I love you so much. I truly love you. I have no doubt that you love me. I'm not doubting it. Remember I told you that. I'm willing to do and support anything that will make you happy. You once told me how to be saved your life. And I'll be so heartless if I stop you from not rewarding him back the way you did. Are you sure that's what Yes. You know I love you. Thanks for understanding. It's okay. Hey, hey! Mrs. Brighton's anticipation! Hey! Oh, that again. Now, wow. <laughs> you don't see how now. The first shall be the last, and the last shall be the first. Yes. Within <laughs> one month, you're already engaged, and the marriage date is fixed. It's God. I'm so happy for you. Thank I mean, who would have you. believed that Brett would ever get serious with life? Mm. Who? I'm so happy That's for nice. you, baby girl. Congrats, 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 congrats. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, my dear friend. Okay, um, so I want to invite you and Bright for Toby's survival party. Okay. Yes. Yes. Though I know Toby's still going to tell Bright. But I want you to know that you both are highly invited for the survival party. Of course. I go there then now. I'm more yeah. sure. And after that, I'll be going home that very day so I can go fix my own home as well. <laughs> <laughs> my worries now is that for you to go and meet your fiancé, that guy has really tried. He has. Yes, he has. But I'm worried. Because I, I feel like my stay in Toby's house is changing him. But I understand him. I understand him. I just don't want to believe that he's cheating on me. I because think. if I catch him cheating... Well... 
I, I don't believe so. No, no, no. He can't cheat on you. He can't. Excuse me. My phone is drinking. Hello, sweetheart. Love, oh, love, one, two, three. <laughs> Of God, you not serve me. Hello? Hey, Dito, Dito. What's up? Ah, this one that you are calling me today. But you didn't come to see me. I told you I am not interested. I don't gamble anymore. You hear me? My friend, get off my phone. Can you imagine? Sorry. Yes? Hey. Can you imagine Dito just called me? Dito? Yes. Telling me he has one sure odd for me to gamble. 10k and win 1 million naira. What did you say? I, I'm not interested. He knew I was sick and he didn't come to see me. Can you imagine? What? You used to gamble. I don't do that anymore. Yeah. I'm a changed guy. So, why, why are you looking this pretty? Just to come and see me? Wait. Toby, did you just say you don't gamble anymore? Did I stutter? I don't. So wait, all oh, this look is just to come and see me. Yes, so see? how are you doing? Well, <laughs> seeing the... I told my man, hey. the man is man. They won, they won, they won, they won. Ah. I, I'm so happy for you. No. See no. us. Love the... Hit you left and right. No, 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 no. Hey, no. No. You are so complete. <laughs> you are so complete. Oh my God. <laughs> Do it for me. Don't worry. God will reward you. Ah, amen. From your mouth to God's ears. I'm actually not here now. That's right. God will do it for you. Yes. yes. But just that, my friend, my very good friend that worked so hard to turn you into a good man, is not here to enjoy it. But his work is here. God knows the best. Hmm? Don't worry. <laughs> my man, my man, my Right too. I'm so happy now that it's done to me again. Thank you. Thank you. Right now, you pop something and we have alcohol more drink. Alcohol. We have alcohol more drink. Let's pop something. Alcohol. Right, I don't take alcohol nor smoke anymore. But I have juice in the fridge. How about which one juice? Very cold juice. I can add ice to it for you. Right, just to quench your thirst. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Bro, hey, juice. There's no problem. There's juice in the fridge. Uh -huh. So what I have to do is to go to that kitchen and fix something for us. Which food? Food. Food. Better food. I drink no problem. Food. There's a there's a call you right foodie. No, I as far as the food come board. <laughs> Ah, you guys are my family now, mm -hmm. and I appreciate you very so much. Mercy. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. 
Mercy, my God. I know you're surprised to see us. It is true I came into your life at a point where things were terrible for you. And I'm aware of the fact that you accepted me out of pity. Yes, because I was all over you, I was pestering around, I was forcing myself to you just to prove how much I love you. But what did I gain? You kept on going back to Toby. Even when Toby was incapacitated, you were there for him. You were playing and flowing with him more than you do with me. I had to go through reality and understand that we were meant to be friends and not lovers. You see, Juliet here, she has been there for me. She has been all over my neck. I can't even count the number of times that we fought. I can't count the number of times that I sent her out of my house. But she kept coming back and begging. That is the type of love we all need. The way you love Toby and the way Juliet loves me. But Missy, how could you? After everything Toby did to you, you still went back to him. I wish you both good luck. As for me, I have decided to move on with Juliet. James, how could you? I mean, how could you do this to me? Huh? To us? How? <laughs> well, if you must know, in my life and the next, I will always be here for you. I mean, James, you showed me nothing but love. True love, unconditional love. And to prove my love and sincerity to you. And to also prove that I have nothing with Toby. I am ready to remain single. If I won't marry you, I would remain single as an honor to prove to you that I still love you. Mercy. 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 Hey, man. We are here for your survival party. Get out. Huh? Get out of my house. It's okay. It's okay. Leave. You heard him. Leave. Get out! Leave! Oh, come down. Thank you. They're gone. It's just it's whatever. Mm -hmm. We we spoil everything. It's okay. Come come on with your food. Let me find something to eat. Yeah. Yes, now. Don't stay at the kind of day. Let's move with your food, guy. Get out of my house. I, mean, I, mean, I, I will break like... your head. Though. I said, get out. Move with your food. Come Let's go. Are you mad?
died so many times knowing that I wouldn't set my eyes on you again. But here you are. Please. I am so sorry. You are the best thing that has ever happened to me. In my next life, I will still want you to be my mother. I promise you on this day that I will never hurt you or make you cry again. Never. Tobias, I've hurt you. And I am happy for your change of attitude. I'm so happy that you've really changed and become the real man I wanted you to be. Stand up. Get up and sit. Sit down. I'm so happy. Honestly, I am happy to see you this way. Um, I have a surprise for you. Material things don't worry. Seeing you alone is what more than can surprise you. Mercy has been. Coming. Mom, I am not doing this for you right now. But I'm here for you to be. And I love you so much. I love you so much. You know that, right? You know, I thank God for the kind of man James is. He read through my heart. And he realized that my heart and soul yearns for you. Hereby making a huge sacrifice to drop all his emotions just to allow reality sail through. Yes. Yes, I know I was with him. But when we connected back, I, I, I don't know. I mean, my spirit and my emotions rested on you. And left James with mechanical attention. And James being the guy with the golden heart. He chose a path, making way for true relationship to hold today. Yes. I am sorry. And I'm grateful. I'm grateful for you and James. This means a lot to me.
Mom and I, we had a serious meeting with James. And we resolved that I should be here with you. <sighs> so now, tell me. What do you see when you look at me? I see a woman with a very big heart. I see a woman that loves me so much. I see myself in your eyes. Just make it just for me. 